Ripped his rage. Attack of the right. Attack of the Rhinox. Enter, enter the uh, uh, enter the hero's tail. Spyro, I know you don't trust me, but I want to help you stop the sorceress. There's a way to open a hidden portal to her lair, but it'll take some very strong magic. If you can find more of the dragon eggs, I think my magic will be strong enough to open the portal. I'll come find you when you have enough eggs, okay? You can find out if it's enough or not. I don't know if I trust you, because us as players have seen her character development, but Spyro hasn't. I love how that's what you're stuck on, bud. Uh, I think it like spits you out like spiral on water. Yeah. I'm not spit you out, but I could just that. Uh, yes. Do you remember my trivia about this home world that I've said like four times in this whole series? Uh, yes, content. That's what I'm here for. This is the only home world where you can die in. Had to fact check me. Confirmed by facts. <clears throat> yes. Yes. Correct. You also have to think, almost every level had money bags in it. And we have a... You get, well, you get the gems back with, in the second game too, it's just more satisfying this way. That's your extra incentive for beating the game. My Ken? I know this isn't contextual to uh, Spyro at all whatsoever, but have you heard about uh, the new um, Scarlet and Violet release for Pokemon? Yeah, Kate and I played it together. <laughs> really good game yeah it's it's like breath of the wild level like you know open world map do whatever you want it's one of the first really truly open world pokemon games that nah, still railroaded you though but this is this is like three ways to beat the game or you know three endings to the game you know you can do all three what Yes, so the three paths to victory are um, the main story, the victory road, which is the gyms and, you know, victory road with the Elite Four, and the Titans, I believe. You did it, Spyro! You found enough dragon eggs for me to unlock the portal! Once I've opened it, you can confront the sorceress whenever you're ready, but be careful, she'll be expecting you. Yes, that is the bonus level. <laughs> Up there. Yeah, so that's the first one. Yeah, that's, that's the super secret bonus level. And then that's the, um, that's the final boss fight. So we're gonna start the episode off with that, right? Yeah. Roll credits. Just the entire homework, ignore it. 
Yeah, she rolled it three times in a row. We're gonna watch it twice because it rolls after you beat the game and after you do the secret stuff too. I'm sorry, I, I misspoke by the way. It's not a, the, the main story ties in between doing all three of them, but um, the three paths you can do is the uh, Team Star, which is their villain team, but it's just school bullies who think they're better than everyone else. Um, yeah, Austin said it. Wasn't Ultra Sun and Ultra Moon Team Rainbow or something where it's all the old teams? Who were like fangirling over Marnie, right? Okay, Team Yell is just fanboys, they're simps. You can't say what the hard heart ganks does. That's a really weird floor you got there. It's, it's cracked and darker than the rest. Yeah, no, move over a little to your right. No, to your right. No, no, to your right. You're going the wrong way. Pop oh, tricks on you. Who's the player? I don't know. People are already simping over one of the leaders, and it's, like, it's not even like the main leader of it. It's just one of the four groups. <laughs> Yeah, let's see. like real men, let's simp over the real stuff, like Spyro. Uh-huh. <laughs> Incorrect answer, you should always simp for Spyro. Oh, the, the race on that is either going to be really fun for you or like mildly annoying because there's two spots you have to go down on that I reset on constantly. Mark my words. No. This is a really good area to farm though because by the time you circle around the whole area, you see how many lizards are here? Thank you. Yes. <laughs> Missing 12 gems and 2 eggs. I know where one of the eggs is, you passed it already. Um, to your left. Man, look at that weird wall. Look at that weird ice wall. Mm -hmm. Magical eyes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. <laughs> I sounded like a half ass <laughs> Joe Joe Swanson was his name. Yeah. Peter. Peter. We gotta, we gotta play Spyro Beater. No, it's more like this. Peter. Oh god. Anyone can do a half ass Lois impression though. What are we missing? Did you did you miss an Okay no you have sparks, I forgot about that. I'm missing a whole egg though too. Oh, behind yeah, behind the behind the beginning area. We didn't go up there. I think there's another little fly section. Shame on me for not remembering that. I know, because I was like, I remember there was another little platform, I just couldn't remember where it was. Oh, that's what I should drink for the next recording session.
Yeah, it's fun to it's fun to like mess around with them, like run around in. There's paths and gaps. You can well, jump well, by. Spyro. Why is he glitched? Look what I have here. It's a life-size space monkey action figure, complete with a fully operational laser. I'd complete love to no let clip. him out so you can play with him, but the sorceress seems to think he's a menace. <laughs> You've always had a weakness oh. for helping silly little creatures, Freezes, haven't you, you, Spyro? Ah, well, I suppose there couldn't be any harm in letting him out. Could there? <laughs> Yippee! I'm free! Thanks, Spyro. Ooh, say, you ever see a bear dance? <laughs> uh, no? <laughs> well, it's your lucky day! Check this out. <laughs> Quite the dancer, isn't he? Not much stamina, though. Too bad no, I don't know. No, he's reaching out of the game. <laughs> Anyway, I heard all about how you've been fighting the sorceress and her armies and kicking all that butt, and I just wanted to say, huzzah! Yippee! Woohoo! Wish you could stay, but my homeworld's been overrun by Rhinox since I've been captured. If you happen to see the sorceress, tell her I'll be giving her dancing lessons real soon. Know what I mean? You bet. Later! Oh, <laughs> uh, yes. We have Australian kangaroo stereotype. Shakespearean. Shakespearean uh, Yeti and monkey with ADHD and a gun. Oh, I didn't know a funny thing for him. Flightless bird. Flight. No, he's a he's a laboratory experiment. That's why it's his lab. Or it's not his lab, but. I I feel like you're reading a little too much into it, bud. She just he made the comment that he's technologically advanced, so he must be from space. Do you think that whenever they make the freeze-dried ice cream that they actually send it up into space? Or is it just called space ice cream because it's stuff that they've had into space before and it's really science-y? What was that? Did you see a Rhinoc? I thought I saw a Rhinoc. You Listen here, you take asshole. it from me, Spyro. Never spend a week in a cage. Mm -hmm. Next thing you know, your whole island will be knee-deep in Rhinox. Well, gotta go. Mr. Laser Blaster and I have a whole lot of work to do. Uh, this ah, level specifically isn't new. You can make it pupil. doom if you want, Welcome though. Welcome back to my island why. laboratory. I'm afraid Rhinox have taken over the entire island. Could you stop them before they That's destroy exactly all my you research? A while ago. Yes, it's exactly. Hey. Sorry, my cat is trying to eat my Warhammer models. This is what I was telling you a while back. I said you, the continuity is completely broken. Like throughout the whole game, it's maintained, but like by the time it gets to the last home, the continuity is completely broken. Because how the hell does he have a lab? Or if he had a lab, why didn't he have this before? I wouldn't say he had been to the realm before. Maybe there's, you know, the, he knows how to make portals, so he can make portals anywhere. The portals to anywhere. what it is though. No call fingers. Coconuts. I think you have to blow them up with like a grenade you get later on. 
It'll be just like old times. Try shooting these dummies to get warmed up, but uh, be careful. I think a Rhinoc might be hiding amongst them. Do you get... Do you get old times so establishing that he's known him for a while? Either that or a bunch of time pass with Rain Spiral 2 and 3. I mean, the, the dragon somehow got like super busy because there was eggs everywhere. Don't need the grenade. Yeah, uh, you can either spam or hold the button down there. He teleported. He teleported. A vast number of Rhinox are waiting to ambush us as soon as I lower this force field. I expect they'll keep coming until you shoot the red panic button next to the door where they emerge. Survive that. Oh. <laughs> I don't know, but we have guns. <laughs> My god. I feel like contextually part of that would be okay. of Rhinox are hiding behind the display screen. I'll switch on the view pedestal and you shoot them as they attack. I recommend using your sniper mode. Your sniper mode. See what kind of shape the machine that. room is in. Uh, I have a feeling the Rhinox have been keeping it too clean. I remember you saying that one or two rooms later and see what you say to that man. Not necessarily. Uh, I would go jump behind there, by the way. Yeah, I can't remember if there's gems or not. Oh, there's not. Huh. Haha, I've wasted your time. Ooh, you look up, though. Look up. It just says a heads up. There's gonna be those all over the island. So I would, I would go ahead and finish off the level and then backtrack. Yeah. Just as I thought, the machine room is overrun with birds. To target the birds in their nests, you'll want to use sniper mode, then zoom in for pinpoint accuracy. Oh. Well, let's see. Nice work, Agent Nine. Uh, I'm not sure if this is a bird egg or dragon egg. Uh, what do you think? 
Imagine bringing an ostrich back to the Dragon Realms. Now I can switch the gravitonometric generator back on. I hope no birds got in here. <clears throat> Yeah, the plot device, one could call it. Let me make double. You know, some people will call your video game method brute, uh, brute force. I think it's an art. The fireworks factory level is going to be a doom level, though. The map is clear, and it smells better in here already. Uh, follow me outside, where I expect <laughs> we'll find some Rhinox wearing armor. You'll need a it more powerful like... weapon to defeat them. It smells like dead bird in here now. So much better. Not even like it's not like chicken, it's an evaporated animal. Engine bird. You killed a war hero, my friend. By my calculations, the bombs in this Deep handy vending fairies. machine should be highly effective against armor. Give it a shot. Disclaimer, I mean actual fairies, not a not any sort of slur. No. I like it. It's like the can it's like the cannon, but you have a you have like direction that it could go. I think your best bet is to run it directly at them because they'll explode as soon as they hit something. Just a few more enemies left. You can do it. Thank you very much for saving my laboratory. Now I can resume thinking. Oh, do you like the fodder, by the way? The beaker, because it's science experiments. It is the chubby pineapples. Yes, do you see how many 25 drums you picked up? You picked up like fucking three of them, I believe. No. It plays a very funny animation at the end though. Okay. 
Holy. I don't think so. I don't think so. Okay. Maybe it was an Anthony you thought was a Tony? That's all eggs, isn't it? Did you get the other gems behind you? You picked up both of them? Okay. You walked and it didn't look like you hit it. in there. No. Yeah. Yes, but look up and make sure you uh, don't miss any as you go by. Now you have to double check for multiple reasons. Bone tree skill point as well as gems. <clears throat> Just to get the circle all the way back. Oh my! Yo, oh my God! You, you filled me with so much pain. The ADHD walk. I wish the side characters played a little more of a role rather than here's a little mission I can do. Set the boss fight. <laughs> but like, see, you could have them peppered through the level and then do stuff in that level. Like, like I like the Sergeant Bird one in the statue place. Remember, where he got to patrol the area. No, 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 not that one. Um, the the second home world. Where we destroyed the sorcerer statue. The gladiator park. Gladi or not the gladiator park. The, the second skate park level. Puppy fetch quest. Where we had to hit the puppy on the buttons. The 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 level was you played a sergeant bird in the same area. The the flossing bone dude. That level. Like I liked that level because you got to play a sergeant bird in the same area. You know what I mean? 
He was like, take a load off, Spyro. I'm gonna go explode. That's what I like. Yes. So just fireworks factory and sparks. Let's go. Yes. I think you would have won that one. It's, uh, it's past the end of the level. It's past the end of the level. Like, go, go into the room. Go into the room. No, that was the gauntlet. That was the gauntlet. The way you had to go through the enemy. Uh, Pondle. Yes. Hey, Spyro! I'm helping a kid named Handel recover some secret rocket plans the sorceress stole. You know I'm always ready to kick some Rhinoc booty! Hi, Agent Nine. Behind those doors are some pretty scary ninjas. I bet you could use your sharpshooter skills to take them out. Remember, press the attack button to shoot, and use the roll left and roll right buttons to dodge left and right. The white, yeah. Yes. Haha, <laughs> you have to use sniper mode. Do you see how weirdly it ricochets and then that one bubble is, it says like hit the hit the the dinosaur after a ricochet? Mm. That's just strafe, isn't it? Since they're spawning in constantly, they're not going to spawn gems. They really said, check this out, what do you like doing? Like this, but bad graphics. Yeah, just imagine if this were bad graphics. No difference whatsoever. Yep, it's fire graphics. Yes. <laughs> that is fodder. Because even though it says you have 100 health, it'll knock you down quarter by quarter. Yes. No, if you want to like make kind of sucky gameplay, um, you can just hold your fire button down. Yeah, but my playthrough, I just held it down and ran through the level. It's really hard to get hit in this level if you're paying attention. You are. Horrible. They're popping from the roof. You'll see them on the roof. One thing I don't like is you don't get sparks, technically. Does that mean in this level you're eating the bugs? 
you're eating the bugs. You're sitting here with a laser guy. I mean, that would be ADHD monkey thing to do. I don't know if I was more the ADHD part of it, just bug. <clears throat> talk about it's fun you're playing doom uh, there's a door right to your uh, box right to your left I think in this room or not I know there's one where there's like a box right to your left or right like right in the doorway. But it says pick up Agent 9's power up. I don't remember what there is though. Room. Yeah. Cause it's been a while since I played this level. I don't know if I 100% skill points in this game because it didn't matter. At least it didn't matter percentage wise. I know it matters in your heart. OB Gulp. Rifto's rage, but it's only my failures and uh, it's only my failures in the gold box fight. Maybe like on the ceiling or the red box that you destroy in the last levels. Yeah, that's the part where I was talking about. It's really hard to get hit because if you even if they're pointing up and aiming at somebody else, when they come in to hit you, they do that fucking backswing. Yeah, they're like, oh, haha, -ha. you go ahead and my forehead. Yeah, that's what I said, the back pedal. Or the wind up, whatever. I think it's to you back behind you to your right, not to your left. Oh, it's 33 hit. <laughs> so you got under 1 HP. Does it? 
Gotta love Spyro, right? Ooh, my knock's got wall hacks. Yeah, that's what it says. Is that is that not the first one? Up on the up on the ceiling in this room. Rescuing me. You'd better look after this egg before the Rhinox try to blow that up, too. Tony's a fucking nerd. I don't know what you thought that was going to do to the kid. You saw his red eyes at the second game. That's a literal god killer there. Yeah. <laughs> Gotta adjust course correct. Except the sparks, yeah. Uh, 15 minutes max. Extra long episode, let's do it.